day six on the Uinta Highline Trail, and I am heading up North Pole Pass, which is right behind me. Uh, I think I'm maybe about halfway through the climb, and yeah, I had to share these views with you. There's Taylor Lake, and I think Quinta Lake or something like that. Ridge line. I think the sun might wash it out a bit, but it's pretty, pretty great view behind me. Pretty high up here, probably at about almost 12,000 feet at this point. But I feel pretty good, not having any altitude issues, which is great. I'd really like to be at Fox Lake by noon or one, but we'll see. We'll see, so far feeling pretty good. Blisters on my little leg aren't hurting too much. So that's nice, I think I'm gonna stop and put some sunscreen on. Cause at this altitude I feel like I'm getting cooked a little bit. But yeah, it's a beautiful day on the Highline Trail. Well, I'm heading up the pass. <sighs> Definitely feeling the altitude a bit, but I seem to be okay. It's a long one, it's tough but it's not too bad. As you can see, there's more to go. And then there might even be more to go after that one at the top. If you can see that, that cairn right there on the top of the ridge. Whew. So far, so good. Glad there's switchbacks on that last part, making it not, not too bad. up to the top of the pass and look at this view. Oh my gosh. This is so beautiful. I wish I could travel faster on this downhill, but it's so rocky. I just have to be very careful about my steps. Make sure that my left foot doesn't go out from under me or don't twist my ankle or whatever, you know, plus trying to navigate my left foot around things when I can't step over stuff. That's definitely a tricky thing, not being able to step over things. So I have to kind of swing my leg around or take littler steps or whatever. It's definitely tricky. I'd like to ride my knee down, but it's hard to do, especially when I don't have two hands, two trekking poles. Yeah. All right. I don't want to get two hands back. Check out this cabin on the far side of. Uh, Fox Lake. It's pretty cool. Nice little one room. Little door. That's pretty neat. So I thought about staying at Fox Lake and just having a shorter day since I climbed a lot, but I took a couple hour break and there were a couple of groups that passed by while I was getting more water and uh, they all said that they were going to Kidney Lakes, which I had been looking at potentially going to. I think it's another four or five miles which would put me at 12 or 13 for the day. Um, I feel like I can do it since it's not, um, like there's not a lot of up and down. I mean, there's some, but it doesn't look too bad. So I think that it should be totally doable. Um, and then 
you know, have some company for the evening, which would be nice. So I hiked on from Fox Lake all the way to Kidney Lakes. And I kind of wish I hadn't. My legs really bothering me. And it's feeling better now that I've had a little bit of a break. But, man, those last couple of miles were really hurting me. Kind of wish I'd stopped at a previous water source that was like a mile and a half, two miles back. That would have been better. Um, but I mean, I'm here and I made a couple of friends. You can see their tents in the back. Uh, two older guys that are from Colorado. So that's been nice. You had a, some, some company. Um, I think they're, they're doing a little bit more miles than me. They did 15 today or I did 12. So. I'm not sure what the plan is for tomorrow. If my leg's really bothering me, then I'll probably just hike six miles to what looks like it'll be a, a flowing stream um, before Anderson Pass. Um, if I'm feeling good, then I might go over Anderson Pass, but then I'd still be having a really long day again. Um, and I don't know if I want to do that. I think, I think it would put me in the realm of 15 miles for tomorrow. I mean, maybe, maybe there's a spot to stop before then with water. I'd have to check, but, um, but yeah, if my leg's bothering me, then I'm just going to take a short day. I'm ahead of schedule anyway, so I think that's what I'll do. So, yeah, I'm enjoying the lake, blind you with the sun. Yeah, it's been nice having some company. I don't know, maybe, maybe I'll camp with some more people again in the future. That'll be nice.